therapists used to, I used to see this a lot, you probably see this in your clinic, that people that do a lot more crazy stuff are in their 20s and 30s and, and there's less crazy people in their 40s that are, are trashing themselves with exercise. Uh, it doesn't mean that you don't exercise. If you can maintain the type of exercise in your 50s or what you're doing in your 30s, you're going to have a much better 60s and 70s. There's no doubt about it. And right. I'm moving to this part of teaching. It's perfectly okay to have long frame and reduce its size to a medium frame to accommodate the leverage and the capacity of the student. And this flows on into a smaller frame where everything is a lot more compact. And this is the type of thing that we might use in falls prevention or with the elderly. In my school, we have a number of students that come to Tai Chi for the first time in their 70s and 80s. And we're not going to go there and teach them large frame. You know, we're going to do a few movements, maybe the qigong, that teach them to open up the joints and move fluid. But in the Tai Chi form, they don't need to have a big sense. It's better them to just work on having good balance, becoming more mindful. Maybe over time they can be more, more comfortable and take a little bit longer stance. You're certainly not going to take someone that's elderly into a large frame situation. And this is where Tai Chi is one of the best exercises to adapt to the people. And that's the most important thing is that the Tai Chi can adapt to the capacity of the person. Not that this Tai Chi is clearly large, medium, small. This is process is a process of life as much as it is this Tai Chi form. Now, we have a situation, you know, we have the Chen Man Ching. It's so easy to see that, that Chen Man Ching, and, you know, thousands of people love this guy, that when he was younger, he was doing a lot larger movements. When he was older and he was in America, especially in the 70s, mm -hmm. his movements changed to just small movements. Mm -hmm. Now, where we have an issue in dissemination is the students follow the old man in small movements and miss so much. And this is not just targeting this person. It is just a real issue. There's a funny saying, you know, Sipu used to say to me, uh, my Wu style is very good. Daimon, your Wu style is very good. This Yang style, you need to open. <laughs> and I 